Hello, I welcome you all. The problem is that the 20 gram bullet is traveling at 400 meters per second when it becomes embedded in the 2 kg stationary block. Determine the distance the block will slide before it stops. The coefficient of kinetic friction within the block and the plane is uh, 0.2. Right, so we have a bullet here that gets embedded in a, uh, in a stationary block. So let's call this B bullet. Let's call this stationary block. All right. So the question here, of course, it will have some some weight. We'll have some weight here, like so. We'll have some weight. We'll have some normal force. Then we'll have some friction in that direction, like so. So this is. Uh, like so and W. All right, so we are going to employ the principle of um, uh, conservation of momentum. So we have state one and state two, only two states here. Okay, state one, state two, um, and the distance, state three. So state three, we are saying this is how far the block will move. Okay. All right. So this is our state three. Let me redraw it properly. Um, imagine the block moves up to there. Let me use black. It moves up to there like so. All right. So let's call this our state three. All right, so we do have, let's say we have, uh, this is summation of um, masses in the first state. Okay, and this is equal to the summation of the same masses, or uh, yeah, uh, the mass summation of masses in the second state. All right, so let's go to state one, state one to two. Uh, state 1 to 2, what do we have? State 1 to 2, we have MB, VB1, plus M stationary block, V stationary block 1. This is equal to MB plus MSB V2. We know that this is stationary, therefore this is zero because our VSB1 is just equal to zero. So here we have um, two grams, I mean 20 grams. This is 20 times 10 to the power negative three. So this we can just write it as 0 0.02, right? Of course, 20 divided by 1,000, 0 0.02 kg then times uh, 400 uh, plus zero. This is just equal to 0 0.02 plus uh, two kg times V2. V2 therefore is just going to be equal to um, 0 0.02 by 400, okay divided by 2.02 .02. so this we get a 3.9604 meters per second in this direction like so this is bullet plus stationary block okay of course uh the question is i mean the distance it will slide before it stops so now we are going to move from uh, state two. We are moving from state two to state three. Okay, state two to three. Is it okay? Mm -hmm. So in this particular state, we have M, MB plus MSB 
vitu uh, sorry uh, in this state um we are saying we have um we're going to use so we we'll use uh the principle of since we want the distance principle of work and energy all right so what do we have we have t2 plus we have t2 plus summation of the wave from 3 2 to 3 is equal to t3 and we know what t is here this is the kinetic energy it's like so and our t3 here is just equal to zero since it will come to the stop and um our u there this is equal to mu k n and n is just equal to w and w is just equal to the weight of the bullet plus the weight of the stationary block which is just equal to 2.02 uh, by 9.81 right so so here we have half we have half m uh, mb plus msb okay v2 squared okay minus mu k n times d then equal to zero all right so here we'll have half uh this is 2.02 uh by 3.9604 squared minus 0.2 uh, by 2.02 .02 by 9.81 by d equal to 0. Therefore, our d from 2 to 3 is just going to be equal to 0 0.5 by 0 0.2 by 3.9604 squared um, divided by 2.02 by 9.81 so this gives us a 3.9971 and therefore rounding off that value will have d itself is just going to be equal to 4.00 meters i think this is about it uh, we have found uh the distance that this particular block will slide before it stops i hope this particular video is helpful and if it was give me a thumbs up like my video continue subscribing and sharing my channel bye bye and i'll see you in my next uh screencast